Now a special report from our NBC7 response team and a look at whether you are paying too much on your monthly cell phone bill. We all we probably think we are, right. right? Well, there might be an easy way to make it cheaper. Consumer Bob spoke to a local company that claims it could do that for you. The more choices you have, the better it is for consumers. So when it comes to cell phone plans, why are we so hesitant to shop around? Let me show you an easy way to save on your plan. When we call or text a friend, chances are we're using one of the big four phone companies and we are slow to change. I've had the same company for over decades. We probably had the same plan for, oh, I guess, uh, 15 years. I'm not happy with the price. I think that um, I'm paying more than I should for just a single phone line. Jenny Litchie picked her cell phone provider more than four years ago and never changed. So why hasn't Jenny shopped around for cheaper, more affordable plans? It's been time consuming, trying to see what plans give you what, how many minutes, how much data, is this gonna work for me? Don't feel that because you're with a certain carrier today, you just have to stay with them for forever. Scott Peterson with Gap Intelligence says people should shop their plans on a regular basis. And that's exactly what a San Diego County business says they can do for you. You basically put in everything you need, whether it's one or two lines, how much data you need, how much text and how many calls you need to make. And you'll be given a list of all the different plans from various carriers that fit within your budget. Tina Chang works for the Encinitas-based company Whistleout, a website that promises to take your mobile and internet history and find the best individual plan for you. It surprises me sometimes how many carriers there are and there are new carriers popping up all the time. Whistleout says it takes your data and looks at 350 plans available from 40 carriers. Some are major players, others are called mobile virtual network operators. Companies that rent tower space from the large wireless companies and charge a fraction of the cost. You could save about 50% off your phone plan by going to an MVNO. And they are cheaper just because they have less operating costs. So what does that mean for consumers like Jenny Litchie? Whistleout says if she switched to a mobile network operator, she could save as much as $420 a year with the same level of service. I think sign me up. <laughs> MVNOs do have some disadvantages. Since they rent network space, they might slow down at a large public gathering like a music festival or Padre game. Whistleout does not charge for their service and say they don't keep any personal information. You can link to their website by going to NBC7.com. For NBC7 Response, I'm Consumer Bob. Mark, Catherine. And Bob says if you are leasing your phones, in most cases you will have to pay it off before switching carriers. And remember, you are allowed to keep your phone number.